versus J3, Zerzu versus Yoshi. Here on Smashville, surprise, surprise. Not that much of a surprise, actually. And it looks like they're going in. Uh, in. So what do you think and J3 is going to do in this matchup? So I feel like he just wants to avoid getting grabbed as much as he can. Just try to space out with eggs. Yeah. Just try to annoy Zero Suit, force an approach. Uh, I feel like Short Hop Arduino is going to be really good for J3 here. Just to get in and get past the Paralyzer without having to run, stop, and perfect shield it. And yep. then be able to at least try to punish with an aerial after it. Plus he's also been doing them to get past all of the nares that Latai is throwing out. Yeah. Able to find an opening, trying to hit him. But Latai is just opening up. Gay through right now. That was a bad spot dodge. A bad shield that shouldn't take it? Yeah. Oh, good DI. Zero suits up B doesn't kill anymore. Well, as early. That's fair. Yeah, so Latai got a... Comfortable lead right now. Back air, probably take it at the ledge. Nice egg to get uh, Lutai sitting in shield. Yeah, that's something that J3 really likes to go for, just conditioning you to shield and they'll just grab you over and over again. Or he can just start hitting you because you're starting to be afraid to shield because he's getting free damage off of it. J3 just kind of just avoiding everything right now. Accidental egg roll. But it worked. I mean, damage is damage. Yeah. You know, once again, just throwing eggs is. Well, Ty just throwing out a bunch of hitboxes. Uh, probably what he wants to do against Yoshi. It seems like with the. Uh, the whip aspect of the Nair to probably beat out a lot of Yoshi's moves. Yeah. And just being able to trade at the, at least at this percent with back air and get a kill off of it should be pretty good. Even, well, I wouldn't say even if he gets his own stock off of it. No, not be out of shield and that'll take it. But, uh, yeah. Good option by J3 reading uh, that most people will just uh, sit in shield when they're waiting for someone to lose, uh, respond if it's ability. Yep. Nice up air from J3 trying to catching the landing. Yep. Once again, we're back to even. Oh, it rolls to avoid the grab. And once again, we're just back to this just slow pace neutral. Neither of them wants to commit too much. If he gets caught by a down air, it does so much percent. Now J3 is a comfortable lead. 30 at the max, right? Uh, I think it's 33, if you hit uh, every single hit. Around 30. Yeah, it's kind of silly. That could have been really bad, but let's I just not opting for the upbeat, just in case he either missed it, it wouldn't have killed anyways. Tries to read an air out of the forward smash. Yeah, let smart being able to di or down B out of it. Yeah. Definitely a good tool of Zero Suits. Can from just what I noticed uh, from playing Latai is his main get out to his Zero Suits is down B, which is, it, which is what it is for most people. Yeah, I believe it has invincibility. At on the, the beginning, yeah. It just gets you really far away. You can always kick out of it, so it's pretty scary to try to ch try to chase it. I believe at this point Latai can get a 50-50 off of down throw. Really? Yoshi's pretty heavy. Which is why he doesn't go that far. Nice tether. No Good. double nair. I'll be at a oh. shield that will take it. Slightly questionable DI. I think he could have lived it. Maybe. Maybe. No, both being at 100%, that's it's not easy to survive at that point. And let's try second game one. So, you usually play with. J3, what does he like to counter pick to? Uh, it usually depends on what character he's fighting. I know that for a thing. So is it kind of like the thing where it's, uh, where it's, if they kill off the top, then he won't go to, like, Town and City or something like that? Yeah. Yeah, FT, I kind of expected it. Yep, because he wants to get rid of as many platforms as Zero Suit can't juggle. I'm also kind of surprised that Latai didn't ban this. I'm not sure what Latai banned them. 
Because it's going to be really hard for him to avoid eggs because he has no platforms that can take them for him. Yeah. He's got no platforms to just continuously up air. I'm not sure. Either way, 41% unanswered. Just kidding. He finally got a hit. <laughs> Anson's trying to land, catches him with an egg lay, but doesn't get a hit off of it. I don't think he's gotten, besides the down B, any punish out of the, the egg lay. I would like to see him just like start going for those smashes to get more damage out of it. Or at least guaranteed damage. Yeah. Trying to set up with the egg, but he whiffs. Good backer. Who doesn't Almost get the fair? Forder. Tether's back to the ledge. Pretty smart. Yeah, Zero Suit's fair. Er, her tether recovery is really hard to punish. It's so fast. Yeah. Uh, You he could just throw out a lingering hitbox there and maybe it would hit her. Yeah. But I'm not that sure. Ooh, good tech. Good tech, but J3 punishing it with an air. Yeah, J3's just re uh, retreating with these fairs. Just trying to be safe. He has no reason to approach right now. Just trying to keep him out. Back um, air almost killing. That was weird, the eye on it. Yeah, it. That move is weird. Good grab. Just getting him off stage. Basically anything would kill Zero Suit right now. Up air. Like an up air. Also, something about Yoshi's back air, it's really weird because it also sends you at kind of an up angle. So, if you even if you DI into Yoshi to not die off the side, you're going to die off the top. Hmm. That's why he went mostly to the corner. I see. It's a, it's a strange move. Gets a Nair, but no punish off of it. I think Yoshi's out of the percent where Zero Suit's combos are going to start working. But Nuppy at a shield doesn't, not doesn't kill. I guess he stole it too much. And Yoshi's fat. You're fat. <laughs> <laughs> also, another thing to note is that Zero Suit is down B. If you don't hit anything, but you land on top of someone, it does act as a footstool. Even know that they have a lot. Don't they have a lot of lag when they do that, though? They do, but what I mean by that is Yoshi's double jump armor most commonly broken by a footstool. Mm. So if you down B when a Yoshi's off stage and trying to come back up with a jump, you, right. you could break it with the if you don't hit anything and it just lands on top of them. Also, slight tech flow by J3. I think that Nair is supposed to be a fair off of the egg that would have spiked. Maybe. Either way, he's got a hundred percent lead right now. A B, oh. this might nope pops out of it. Got some ash di from J3 to get out of that. He doesn't try to punish the landing of the up either. Oh, that could have been really bad. And once again, just J3 just not wanting to approach, trying to force the tie to try to commit to something. Zero Ooh, good tech once again. Zero does have the combo tools to actually still end his stock right now. He's approaching up B kill percent. Ooh, good beat. Nice forward smash. J3 is going to take the second game. Right, so I think he's going to ban the Dreamline or Lilat. I would say he'd ban Dream, uh, Dreamline. <laughs> so we'll probably see Battlefield out of Latai. Yeah. Oh, Zero Suit on Battlefield. Still scary. Even though the ceiling is higher, she can still get you all the way up there. Steven. Score. One one. Yeah. And we're going to Dreamland. And apparently I was just called for a match, but I am commentating right now. That's unfortunate. Let's anyway, we're here on Dreamland. I'm not sure what J3 banned if we're on this stage. Maybe he banned Battlefield? I don't know. Yeah, maybe. Either way, here's the up air starting, but he lands with the down air. 30% just trying to land. That's dumb. <laughs> Yoshi's a good character, guys. I don't think he wanted a dash attack out of that paralyzer. I wouldn't doubt it. I wouldn't doubt oh. it, but then if you think about it, uh, one other way that people would have to grab to actually get a dash tag out of it is by hitting a shield button and their attack button. Oh. Because that's how grabs come out. 
Interesting. Oh, barely missing the fair, and he gets back here for it. Yeah, she's trying to get back to the stage. That was... I don't think he meant to do it, but that was an okay option select. If J3 managed to air dodge the back air, he would just forge after it. Hmm. So either way, he was guaranteed damage. And if he got hit by the back air, he most likely would have died. And even if he didn't die, then he would be off stage. Yeah. Good up smash catching the landing of the down B. Nalatai just wants to just kind of sit back, try to get as much extra damage as he can get right now. Nice pivot grab. grab. Back throw. I'm guessing it's just just to damage. get him off stage. Or that. Short hops. Trying to bait something out. Probably a grab. Up to allow the shield. And one thing JA3 is really good for, he's very patient. Even though he's down a stock, he doesn't mind slow, just playing really slow. Just trying to force Latai to lose his patience. Good forward air. Oh, he air dodges into the paralyzer. Jab and dodge smash, gonna take it. That was that was tipper jab dodge smash, and when you hit tipper jab, they basically move nowhere. I believe it's they move nowhere, but they also go higher. Huh. I didn't actually know that. I thought it just always worked. I'm not sure. I think it just makes it more true. But, uh, yeah, Tipper Jab doesn't move him anywhere. I mean, it slightly moves him forward or away from you, but it mostly brings him up. See. Oh, he pops out of the Paralyzer right before the forward smash. And J3's got quite the hill to climb. Yeah, but, but that could have been really bad for Latai, yeah. actually. I believe if J3 actually came down with a downer, it would have clipped him out of the, uh, the tether. And he, he's kind of making this comeback. He's just playing really smart, avoiding these hits. Already got him up to 76. And Yoshi can kill. All he needs is a couple more percent. I believe more a downbeat will kill, actually. Now it will, for sure. Oh, he oh, got 2-3. That's going to be it. An unsafe up smash once again. The tie takes it 2-1 over your 8-3. I believe myself and Spearwing have matches to play. Yep. So we will be getting off. Yep. Hopefully we'll get someone to replace us really soon. See ya.